We are seeing a few spotty showers and thunderstorms moving through the UP. At this point, most of the activity is moving through central and eastern parts of the UP. We are seeing some clearing over the western edge of the UP. We have some showers and thunderstorms moving through eastern Marquette County over into Alger County, also affecting parts of northern Schoolcraft County. There's another thunderstorm just to the south of the Iron Mountain area heading through Menominee County and a few raindrops getting into western Delta County. Temperatures are at 70 degrees in Marquette. It's also 70 in Iron Mountain. They've been a little bit up and down as some showers have rolled through. Then we've seen a little bit of clearing and uh, the temperatures uh, rising again after those showers have moved out. 74 degrees in Barriga, 67 in Escanaba and 65 in Munising. Temperatures this evening will be heading into the lower 60s and then upper 50s after midnight. Early tomorrow morning, we're going to start Start off with lows near 52 degrees. Morning temperatures will pretty quickly rise into the 60s and then tomorrow afternoon we'll be heading into the upper 70s close to 80 degrees for some areas. Winds currently are coming out of the north in Marquette at 12 miles per hour. Northwest winds in Munising at 14 miles per hour. We've seen this flow developing off of Lake Superior, but elsewhere winds are generally coming out of the south. South southeast winds in Iron Mountain at 8 miles per hour. South winds in Escalade at 12 miles per hour, a bit lighter in Houghton out of the south at 6 miles per hour. We're seeing this line here of some higher instability that's been generating some scattered showers and thunderstorms through parts of the UP and also into northern Wisconsin. That's going to be moving to the east. We'll see some clearing taking over tonight. But then tomorrow afternoon, we are going to have another chance of some pop up showers and thunderstorms for tonight becoming partly cloudy lows near 54 degrees in Houghton, 51 in Escanaba, 56 degrees in Big Bay, 52 degrees in Ishpeming. Then for tomorrow, some early breaks of sunshine and we'll see some on and off breaks of sunshine in the afternoon, but also a chance of some spotty showers and thunderstorms. Highs getting up to 83 degrees in Iron Mountain, 79 degrees in Houghton, 76 in Escanaba. We'll find mid 70s close to the shoreline, a high of 75 in Marquette, getting up to 80 degrees in Republic. So for tonight, we will find our skies becoming partly cloudy and it's going to be a dry start to the morning tomorrow. Then in the afternoon, a few pop up showers and thunderstorms will be possible. Those will drift towards the east southeast and there will also be weakening heading into tomorrow evening. Then for Friday, we're going to see mainly sunny skies setting up over the air area along with warmer temperatures moving in and with the heat in mind later this week, you'll certainly want to have a plan to be in air conditioning or at least limit time outside. If you are outside, seek shade. It is going to become very hot this weekend, so you will want to drink plenty of water and avoid caffeine and alcohol because those will cause you to get dehydrated and you'll want to wear loose fitting light colored clothing. That's best in the heat and if you're hanging out in the sun, apply sunscreen every two hours. For tomorrow, highs heading up to 79 degrees, possibly a shower thunderstorm in the afternoon, evening temperatures near 70. Friday morning, temperatures rising from the upper 50s to 60s. Wolf highs getting up to 83 degrees for Friday afternoon, along with mostly sunny skies. Saturday morning, starting in the mid 60s, climbing to the 70s during the morning. Wolf afternoon highs heating up to 90 degrees on Saturday. It's going to be partly cloudy and hot and not a whole lot of relief in the evening with temperatures in the lower 80s and 70s. On Sunday morning, temperatures starting off in the 70s, a bright and hot day with highs heading up to 90 degrees, evening temperatures near 80. Possibly a few spotty showers early in the day on Monday, remaining warm with highs in the middle 80s.